I think probably the number one leadership skill. Um, even more now, because now everybody is in the world of presenting since, you know, we all started doing things on Zoom all the time. Now everybody's a presenter. You know, there's always this thing about there being natural born presenters, natural born speakers. Are there? Yes, they are. But they're few and far between. And my question, because I'm not a natural born speaker or a natural born presenter, um, but my, my question was, um, so how do you do it? How do I become a, an excellent presenter, an excellent speaker? And the thing I love about NLP is it's very procedural. Um, it has, you do this, you do this, you do this, you do this, and this will happen. Um, so, you know, as a speaker and presenter, what are the steps to get rid of my nerves or my fear? What are the steps to get rapport with an audience? What are the steps for structuring my content in a way that people immediately get it? And NLP's got that, you know, which is why we've done those kind of trainings for uh, PricewaterhouseCoopers Financial Management Consulting Group. Uh, we've done it for um, Microsoft Mobile Devices. Uh, we did it for um, the PR department of British Telecom. Uh, we did it for British Telecom International Marketing. People had wow moments. Possibly one of the biggest wow moments being, wow, I can do this. <laughs> when previously, when they arrived, they didn't believe that they could.